Seemed like a good time as any. Uh, three records and out always seemed like a good motto. Um, seemed like a good time. So, Enough. Was it very important to you to kind of go out with a bang when you were still kind of at the top? I mean, I wasn't worried about it. Like, like oh, we, I want to go out on top in like kind of a stressful way. Like, but um, why not have a good show? Like, I think that's more fun than sort of like going away for two years then quietly just being like okay we're not a band anymore that doesn't seem like fun it seemed more fun to be like hey let's just call it a day now and more risk and what kind of made you want to document the end in this one i hadn't really thought of it we were trying to make a movie about other stuff and um then then we they, we wanted a shot of the balloons okay and uh of the balloon drop, but it was so expensive to shoot in Madison Square Garden that we decided, we were like, well, we might as well just film the whole concert. We almost didn't, and then uh, when we did, we were like, boy, I'm glad we did that, because that would have been dumb to not film that. So, it, wasn't, it was kind of a bunch of small decisions rather than a large decision. Do you think you have to be like a massive fan of those sounds to enjoy the film, enjoy the journey? That's hard for me to be outside of as an idea. Um, it, was, it was part of the goal of the film, to not, I mean, we have the concert film as well, which is like four hours of just music. And I think, to some degree, you have to be a fan of the band to enjoy that. But like, they weren't really wanted to make a movie that was like a movie, like a narrative film, uh, in which the music is sort of like, if it was a war movie, those are like the battle scenes, um, rather than like just a, uh, a thing for fans. So, I mean, I, I it's that that's much harder for me. I can't experience it as a person who doesn't know that isn't me. That's the best I can do. I've always been terrible at that.